it's just a great feeling to be involved with something that makes people so happy. Everybody has an individual path they all go on. Hopefully, these experiences make them find and meet other children like themselves and they get to know each other long term. So as we go year to year to year, they're going to continue to build these friendships and these social experiences. We did some judo, some... He threw me around a lot. Yeah, I threw him around a little <laughs> bit. Um, I we... threw him around once. It was fun. It's the ability to connect and understand that there are other kids out there just like them. At my high school or in my life, there's not, there's basically just me who's visually impaired. So it's really nice to like come and like be with visually impaired people because you're kind of all sharing like a similar challenge. So it's really, it's just easy being able to relate to them. It was a good day today. We went tandem biking, we went, we did judo, we did goalball, and my day was great. We're now able to do even go beyond things like tandem biking and goalball. We're able to do judo and bring in professionals and um, host tournaments and that's just amazing. We get people from all over the country now knowing who we are and saying that they want to help. Um, and it is way more than just sports and athletics. I and mean, the confidence that you build in athletics helps you in every other aspect of your life. As far as I'm concerned, anything that we do for these kids gives them one more step to independence and having an active life. I feel proud of myself. The community of people that we have involved with the students, um, I think that, you know, the possibilities are really endless for young visually impaired kids. Anything is possible. If you want to do something, never be afraid or feel like you're not able to do it. As long as we can be helping kids and families and schools, I want to be up there in front and be a part of that. I wish I could have stayed at Goalball longer. <laughs> That's my favorite. It's a lot to sustain programs that we offer and we want to keep introducing more because we want to do so much for the community and keep growing. It was a fun day. It was a very fun day. Very fun day. I think it should be obvious the amount of growth that we've had. I mean going from helping six in our first year to over a thousand kids each year um, and that's made possible by all the donors. That's made possible by people who pull out that checkbook. Um, and in order to keep seeing that kind of growth and success and the, the awesome programs that we offer, and of course we need that. Um, we need your support. These kids are like, they're just so amazing and they don't get these opportunities everywhere they go. And to, to see them when they come here and they're having a good time, um, pushing their limits and and then they're successful and just you can see it in their face it's it's one of those things every time I come here to one of these events the kids are high-fiving me saying hey Scott I'm so glad we're doing this again it's the best thing I've ever done and I hope they go on to then push themselves in in their entire life